Hello, in this video we're going to do a problem that looks at time cost trade-offs and finding the optimal duration of a project. So the time cost trade-off for developing a new energy drink, let's say, so we got a company that's going to develop a new energy drink, is given by the following. The cost equals 200 minus 10 times t plus 1.25 times t squared. C is the dollar cost of developing this project. T is the number of months until the new energy drink is available for sale on the market. So it takes time to develop a new drink. The present value of gross profit from the new energy drink is given by the following equation. So this is a present value of gross profit, 400 minus 1 half T where T, again, is the number of months until the new energy drink is available for sale. And what we want to find here is what is the optimal duration for the energy drink's development. So, you know, we could try to rush the energy drink, bring it to market quickly. That might entail very high cost. So what is the optimal duration of developing this product? So it's going to maximize profit, where profit is the gross profit R minus these uh, development costs. And so just substituting in here, R is 400 minus 0 0.5 T, and we're going to subtract out C, the cost. So just rewriting that last step here. So this is just R minus C. And now I'm going to distribute this minus sign through what's in parentheses. So it's minus 200 minus minus 10t is plus 10t minus plus 1.25 leaves us with a minus 1.25t squared. And so now we're going to try to find our optimal value for t. So we're going to maximize profit here with respect to our choice variable t. So I take the derivative of this with respect to t, the derivative of 400 is 0, the derivative of minus 1 half t is just minus 1 half, the derivative of minus 200 is 0, the derivative of 10t is 10, and finally the derivative of minus 1.25t squared is going to be minus 2.5t. 2 times 1.25 is where this 2.5 is coming from, and then I subtract 1 from the exponent. 2 minus 1 just leaves us with t. We're maximizing, so we're setting that equal to 0. So now we're just going to solve this equation here for t. So 10 minus 0.5 is 9.5. Adding 2.5t to both sides, we get this result. And dividing through by 2.5, t equals 3.8, or 3.8 months in our case. Okay, that's it. I hope you found this video helpful.